back to the channel everyone thank you so much for stopping by today we are going to grill pompano fish if you've never had pompano it is a fantastic fish to grill it cooks up literally in 10 minutes start to finish and uh, it's one of those ones that uh, it's kind of foolproof and uh, we've got a super easy recipe for you today let's get inside and I'll show you how to put it together so if you have not seen pompano it's relatively small fish not too thick the nice thing about it is there's not a lot of bones um, that are difficult to pull out that you would get for some of these pan fish. This is very fresh. I got it uh, at one of our local fishmongers. You can see that the actual eye of the fish is super clear. There's no scent. That's exactly what you're looking for. This recipe is very, very simple. So in order to get this ready to grill, what I'm going to do is I'm going to coat it with some olive oil inside and out. And then I'm going to sprinkle it with lemon pepper on the inside and then I'm gonna put a little bit of kosher salt on the outside we're gonna grill it on our grill our grill is set up to about 400 degrees of direct heat and I'm gonna oil the grates before I put it on there it's gonna probably take two to three minutes I'll flip it over we'll do it another minute or so there you don't want to overcook it when we're done we'll come back in and I'm gonna put some of the chopped parsley on it and we're ready to eat so let me show you how this comes together a little olive oil. We're going to use our hands to make sure that it goes all over the fish. Inside and out. Now a little bit about the pompano fish, it's a white fish, it's a little bit more oily than say tilapia, it's somewhat dense, you can see it's, it's a light colored fish, when you cook it up it's nice and white. The really nice thing about it being oily is it has a just a wonderful flavor, it's almost like, it's, it's kind of like a little bit buttery, and so if you've never had it I'd highly recommend giving it a try. And I'm just going to cook this, uh, like I had mentioned before, we're going to cook it over direct heat. I'm using B&B &B oak charcoal, and it shouldn't take but five minutes or so to get done. I'm going to do a little bit of kosher salt on the outside. and then into my lemon pepper. Then lemon pepper on the inside doesn't take a lot. It has a great flavor. This specific blend of lemon pepper has garlic in it. It also has onion powder. Tastes fantastic on the grill. You know what, I think for good measure, because the way that we have this cut I'm just going to go ahead and put some on the outside too. Making sure all sides have some of it on it. Okay. And that's it. Let's go out to the grill. I'll show you what it looks like when I put it on the grill, when we flip it over, and then we'll come back and I'll show you what the final dish looks like.
Okay, we're back inside. It took about 10 minutes to finish the pompano. Let's take a look and see how well we did. I'm just going to take this middle piece. And as you can see, I'll lift it up for the camera. It's a white fish, but it has a little bit of oil. Look how juicy that is. Let's cut into it. Take a look. Look at that crispy skin. Comes right off. Looks perfect. And what better accompaniment than some garlic aioli broccoli. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon.